Today's video topic is ruptured appendix. The appendix is a small pouch located in the lower right abdomen, near the junction of the small and large intestine. It is part of the body's digestive system, but its exact purpose is unknown. While the appendix is not essential for survival, it does help to protect against infection. But sometimes it can become inflamed, which is known as appendicitis, and it can lead to a ruptured appendix if left untreated. What is appendicitis? Appendicitis is the medical term for the inflammation of the appendix. This can be caused by infection, blockage of the appendix, or other conditions. Symptoms of appendicitis include abdominal pain, nausea, swollen belly, and vomiting. You may also have loss of appetite, fever, and an increase in white blood cells. If left untreated, the inflamed appendix can burst, causing a serious medical emergency known as a ruptured appendix. Causes of a ruptured appendix. The most common cause of a ruptured appendix is an infection of the appendix. This can be caused by bacteria, parasites, or viruses. These bacteria can grow causing a block and an inflammation. When it is not treated quickly, the pressure of bacteria inside can cut the blood supply, which leads to death of the cells, which then causes a hole in the wall, leading to leaking bacteria to the abdominal cavity. After the appearance of symptoms, if left untreated, the appendix can burst in 48 to 72 hours. Other causes of a ruptured appendix can include an obstruction of the appendix, an abscess, or a tumor. Treatment of a ruptured appendix. The treatment for a ruptured appendix is usually surgical. Surgery involves removing the appendix and any infection in the abdominal cavity. Sometimes if there is a bacteria-filled abscess, your doctor will insert a tube to drain the pus and bacteria and then perform the surgery. Antibiotics will also be prescribed to help fight the infection and prevent further inflammation. So you will take antibiotics before and after the surgery, but in most cases, it won't exceed six days or a week. Your doctor may also prescribe painkillers after the appendix is removed. As for the recovery, it can take up to six weeks to recover from the surgery. And during this period, you should keep the incision clean and avoid any sports or any activity that requires vigorous efforts like lifting heavy weights. If the patient is a child, then the doctor may recommend staying in a hospital for a week or so. Complications of a ruptured appendix. If the appendix is not removed in time, the infection can spread to the abdominal wall and other organs, leading to serious health complications, such as sepsis, which is a life-threatening condition. It can also cause an abscess to form in the abdomen and lead to a hole in the wall of the intestine. Prevention of a ruptured appendix. You can't prevent the inflammation of the appendix, but you can talk to your doctor as soon as you experience its symptoms. Thank you for watching our video. Please do not forget to like and share the video. Also, please subscribe to the channel to stay updated on our latest videos.